The first thing um, that for new cases that will be filed is the landlord will come down and file a notice of claim uh, through our small claims court on an eviction case type. Tenants will receive that notice of claim, uh, will be served either uh, by private process server through the sheriff's department or possibly certified mailing, uh, which will give them a court date to appear for uh, a hearing on the order for possession that is being requested by the landlord. The first hearing is a possession hearing. It is not a uh, what we call a money hearing. It's not determining total amounts due and owing, um, but the first hearing will be about whether the landlord will get the order for possession and have the tenants removed. Upon receipt of that notice of claim for tenants who have not gone through the process and aren't familiar with the process, uh, there are a variety of resources out there for them. Uh, they can certainly consult with legal counsel, find an attorney on their own. Uh, we have resources through the Neighborhood Christian Legal Clinic and Indiana Legal Services who can provide them with guidance and advice um, from attorneys. Also, if they have not yet explored renter assistant programs that have, you know, we have those in place. We have those in place for Allen County. We have those in place for the city of Fort Wayne. And they are providing assistance up to 12 months um, of past due rent and including um, some forward, like maybe three months forward of rent, as well as uh, help with utilities. So if a tenant has, and a landlord have not explored those options, they really need to do that. The city of Fort Wayne, through community development, has a um, emergency renters assistance program so anyone who's living in the city of Fort Wayne can utilize that program and then statewide um, for tenants and landlords who have properties that are outside of the city limits but in Allen County there is also a statewide program that they can go to at which is the indianahousingnow.org um, and there's a website there where they can fill out um, the necessary uh, paperwork and see what documents they would need to get some of that renter's assistance out there. Um, so if tenants have not um, exercised that option yet and landlords have not explored that with their tenants, that is something they really need to do. When you are served with that notice of claim for an eviction hearing, there's likely going to be a very quick hearing scheduled on the court's calendar. Um, we provide a minimum of 10 days notice from the date that that notice of claim is received or served on the tenant until that hearing date. So it could be a week and a half to two weeks from the time they get that notice until that hearing occurs. So diligence and, and being very timely at, you know, reaching out for help or exploring options with programs or finding out from your landlord if there are maybe some options with renters assistance programs um, they need to do it very quickly. It's important for landlords and tenants to reach out um, outside of the court and the clerk of the court for any help they need in maneuvering through an eviction or any type of case that they have pending. Uh, court staff, clerk staff cannot give legal advice and while they may not think that's what they're asking for, outside of procedural type questions, they really aren't able to be of any help. Um, and, and so they have to be very careful of what kind of questions they can answer when people do come to them or call them. So it is important to find these other resources. Um, you know, in, in, in addition to the ones we've mentioned, you know, when the pandemic hit, Fort Wayne also set up a renter assistance program, and there's a number that um, tenants can call for that, as well as statewide, there is a program for potential settlement conferences with landlords and tenants to work with a facilitator to try to find a resolution. Um, and there is a website and a link where landlords and tenants can go to request participation in that program as well um, to try to reach a resolution of the dispute um, before it goes to trial.